on a relatively cold morning. Doug, can you tell us about the film? Uh, well, basically, the, the film Vigilante is about a social worker who gets tired of seeing kids abused, and he decides to do something about it. That's really the long and the short of it. It's, it's like, um, he's just a regular guy who takes matters into his own hands. Are, are you taking a different approach with it than maybe other subject matter that films have touched on? Well, you know, some people say that we are, but the basic thing is that, is that um, the stories are real. I mean, of course these people's names have been changed and everything, but, but what you see in the film is, is what happens in real life every day. And we just kind of want to bring awareness to it. Okay, can you talk about working with uh, Joe and Stephen? Oh, well, I got two words for, for working with Joe. Really good. I mean, I had no idea. I, he just, he just blew me away. I mean, um, you know, and everybody seemed to have their opinion about what they thought he was going to be like, but they never met the guy. And it was my first meeting him, too. Uh, when, when we got together, and it's like, uh, he's definitely a professional, definitely a professional. <laughs> and he makes everyone around him come up. Any particular characters you picked due to history or uh, experience-based? Uh, no, actually, um, all these characters are based on... Uh, characters or people that I heard about um, and I'm, 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 I have to answer this carefully because I don't want my wife to get in trouble <laughs> because basically for the last 13 years she would come home and I really wouldn't be listening all the time but she'd be saying well you know this happened at work and that happened at work and I guess she was really putting it inside of me because when it came to write the story it was no problem to write the story they just all those stories just came out. They just came out. And because they were in there, I didn't even realize they were in there until we started talking about the subject. And she says, uh, uh, why, don't you, why don't you write a, a story about uh, a social worker that, that really goes out there and, and punishes people that abuse kids? And when she said that, it just triggered all the information that she had put in me over the years. Excellent. By comparison to other films that you've worked on, any uh, big differences in this one? Anything new you're working with or something new you're trying? Or? Well, basically, the basic difference is, is that I directed a film called Baby's Mama Drama a few years ago, and with a lot of... Uh, the storyline was good, and it was a good a good attempt at trying to get a message across, but the problem was um, nobody knew any of the actors that were in the film. So when it came to dis getting distribution for the film, uh, it wasn't possible because the first thing a distributor asks you for is who's in it. And I've never been able to answer that question. So at that time I decided, well, I'm not doing any more films until I can get some real actors, some real name actors in my films. Okay, right, this is the time. All right. Uh, Thank you much.